Hello my loves, I hope you're all really really well, welcome back to a brand new video. So today I have got a absolutely huge new in Zara and H&M haul. Um, I've been collecting some really really cute spring summer pieces over the past few weeks. I have a, a little feeling that you guys are really really gonna love, <clears throat> croaky, love all of the pieces that I'm gonna show you in today's haul. So as always everything will be linked down below. So get cozy, get yourself a nice drink, get some snacks and I really really hope you enjoy this video. So today Today's video is very kindly sponsored by Karma, which is an app and also a Google Chrome extension, which will save you so much money. Now, Karma actually used to be called Shop Tagger, which you guys have heard me speak about so much. Um, I have used this religiously for the past few years and it saved me so much money. I use Karma every single time I do any online shopping, which is, let's be honest, a lot. If I'm on my desktop, I will use my Google Chrome extension and if I'm on my phone, obviously I'll use my app. It's absolutely free, which is a huge plus. It helps me keep all of like my wish list really organized, which I love. And it also has an online coupon scanner, which is brilliant. So when you're at the checkout of whatever you're buying, Karma will actually automatically scan the internet for a coupon. And nine times out of 10, there'll be an offer on so you can save yourself money. As you guys know, I'm forever getting some right bargains on Zara because Karma actually notifies you when an item that you've had your eye on goes into the sale. So it really, really is such a useful tool to have. So once you click the link in the description box, you will need to create a Karma account, which is super easy. And then once you've made a Karma account, you will need to add the button to your toolbar, which is again, super easy. All you need to do is click add to Chrome, add extension, and then the little blue Karma button will appear in the top right hand corner. Then you can browse through thousands of stores on Karma. You can also search in at the top a store that you are looking for. So I'm gonna head over to one of my favorites, which is Zara Home. This is a lamp that I have been eyeing up for the longest time. I'm just patiently waiting to save some money on it and for it to finally go into the sale. So I'm actually going to save this item so Karma can notify me once it goes into the sale. And then you can select when Karma actually notifies you. So you can select 50% off, 25% off. I always select any price change. And then you can also save it as well to a personalized list, which I love. So I'm gonna save it to my home interior list. And then as easy as that, as you can see, it's saved to my personalized home interior list. I love being able to keep everything just super organized. You can create as many lists as you like by clicking new. I'm gonna create a summer one for more summery pieces that I find. Another one of my favorite features, which I use every single time I shop online, is the online coupon scanner. So every time you add something to your basket and you head over to the checkout, Karma will actually automatically scan the internet for coupon code, which is so convenient and it saves you so much money. The coupon scanner is actually exclusive to Google Chrome, so be sure to download Karma for your desktop as well as your mobile. And then last but definitely not least, Karma actually has a cashback feature. So whilst you're shopping online, you can earn money through PayPal. There are so many stores that offer cashback. You can see a few here. So my loves, I will leave a direct link to Karma in the description box below. Make sure you download as like I said, it's completely free and it will help you save so much money. So we are going to start with H&M today. Um, I love Zara and H&M, but I feel like if I had to choose one right now, it would be H&M. I just feel like it, it has a piece of my heart at the moment. And me and H&M go way, way back. And I kind of have a bit of a love-hate relationship with the Zara website. So we are going to start with H&M today. Okay, the first item. I didn't need, actually, to be completely honest, the last thing I needed in my wardrobe was another trench coat, but look, would you be able to resist this? I think not. Now, this is linen, it's white, it's thin material as well, so it's gonna be perfect for the next, let's be honest, the rest of the year. In England, we have a heat wave and then it snows. So I feel like a nice trench coat really is, I say this in every single haul, a staple to your wardrobe. I loved this one because I felt like this was different. I say that every time as well. I feel like this one was different to all of the other ones I have. It's linen, it's white. It has these gorgeous tortoiseshell buttons. Um, and it's just such amazing quality. Like it has so much detail. 
I just, I love this so much. This one's my favorite. I say that every time as well. It has these tie details on the sleeves and this is actually really, really long. But just for reference, I'm just under five foot four. I'm usually a size eight to 10 in clothes. Um, the only thing with H&M and Zara actually, their sizing is extremely whappy. Like sometimes H&M, I'm a size eight. Sometimes I'm a size 14. It's literally so hard trying to guess which size you are. Um, they only had two sizes in this. They had a small to medium and a medium to large. The small to medium was sold out, so I got the medium to large, which does come up really quite oversized. Um, but I don't really mind. You guys know I love oversized clothes. Yeah, I feel like this coat is an Instagram favourite at the moment. Instagram made me do it. So many people have this coat and they look so nice in it and I was like... I need it. Okay, next we have this gorgeous dress. I posted a picture wearing this on my Instagram about two weeks ago and you guys absolutely loved it. It sold out. Um, when I checked the other day, it was back in stock. I would just say keep checking every few days because it does come in and out of stock. Um, so this dress is a little bit out there for me, I'm not gonna lie. But, I don't know, it just felt really springy. I love the little flower details on it. I love the shape of this dress. So this dress has these gorgeous puffy sleeves which you can wear on your shoulder or also off your shoulder. Um, the neckline also is like a gathered kind of material which looks so flattering. Such a lovely dress for spring summer. So perfect for little picnics and I thought this would just look so delicate pair of like white sandals, maybe like a little straw bag. Um, just such a cute little outfit. Now, I must confess, this dress is a little bit orange because I have been wearing it, um, so just ignore that. But you guys may remember this from a very recent vlog. I have been back on H&M and bought this in nude and black um, because I just find this the perfect throw-on dress. When it's warm, we had a little heat wave a few weeks ago and it was... It was a bit of a shock to the old system and I needed something that was just nice and flowy but I still felt like a little bit dressy in. Um, and the worst in the summer for just wearing like an oversized t-shirt and just feeling a bit like not very dressy. This is a midi dress. It's this gorgeous like shirt material, but it's not stiff. Like it's a really like soft shirt material. And it has this tie detail on the waist, which is so nice. I feel like without this, it would look a little bit like nothingy. Um, and it wouldn't be very flattering and it would kind of just hang off your body a little but this dress would be the most perfect thing just to throw on on a hot day and um, with some nice accessories you could have a nice straw hat a little straw bag some nice sandals and also this dress is the perfect dress for when you're on holiday you've had a day by the pool you want to go out for lunch you've still got your bikini on because obviously you're going to go back to the pool after lunch and you just want something nice and dressy to throw on to go get a glass of wine or a nice lunch and I feel like this is perfect. Okay, next we have got another dress. Really, really loving just like crisp white dresses at the moment. I just think they look perfect in the spring summer and they're just really fresh. Um, so I picked up this one. I loved the detail on here. This one was a little bit more expensive. I feel like this was about £40 which I do think is a lot for a plain white dress. Um, but I just think the detail on this one is beautiful. So it's got this like cutout detail here. It's got a frilly high neck. And then it also has the cutout detail on the sleeves as well. And I just thought this would be perfect for so many occasions. You could really dress this up. Um, if you're going for a nice dinner or you've got a wedding, I think this could look really lovely. It's also like, um, it's not a smock dress. It's like an A-line dress. So it's not too puffy, but it's not skin tight either. I can't do tight in the summer. For people that can wear tight clothes in the summer, I salute you because I can't. Honestly, my body swells in the summer and I just, I just like to wear things that make me feel free. I got this in a size small. I also got this one in a small as well. I think I forgot to mention. Okay, next we have got the most gorgeous blazer ever. I love sage green at the moment. Um, it's a new a new colour that I've added into my wardrobe. And these blazers are brilliant quality for the price they are. I think they're about £30. I'm sure they're £29.99 which is amazing. Um, so sizing on this I always get my blazers in an extra large, like always, 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 because I really like 
the shoulder pads to come out and I like to be able to wear like a hoodie underneath. Now this one is a little bit too oversized for me. I feel like I would have preferred the large. Gorgeous colour, goes with everything. I love blazers because I feel like they just make anything a little bit more smart. I feel like for a wedding you could wear the blazer over the top of one of these dresses and it would just make it look that little bit more smart. I love white and sage green together like I just think they look so pretty. A yeah, really really lovely quality blazer for the price that it was and then I also picked up the nude version as well. Um, again I got this in an extra large it is quite oversized but I felt like as well this would just go with so much in my spring summer wardrobe over any dress I can just pop it over my shoulders if it gets a little bit chilly and it will instantly just make that outfit look a little bit more dressy okay the last item of clothing i've got to show you from h and i've also got some accessories um and i've also been buying loads from h and m home so if you would like to see h and m home haul that was a mouthful just let me know and i'll film that really really soon um so the last thing i picked up again sage green I picked up this lovely sweater which says Malibu on it really really faintly and I just I think you can't go wrong with a nice sweater um, perfect for spring summer with a nice pair of denim shorts um, and they're just like nice and cozy to take out with you I loved the color of this and I thought this would look really really nice with with like a creamy colored pair of shorts or you could also wear cycling shorts with this I thought that would be a really nice little spring outfit okay recently I'm absolutely loving a headband I just think they are so pretty um, I've never really been a massive headband kind of gal um, but I just think they really I don't know I feel like they're really pretty so I picked up this nude one which has got like a crisscross detail I shall try on for you oh I really like this one sometimes ones with like this knot in the middle do make my head look a little bit of a funny shape um i've got a black velvet one with a little like bit here and i sound, i don't know there's something about it that just kind of like makes me i find a lot of people look at my head when i wear it a headband just really dresses up an outfit like even with just like a plain shirt dress like the one i've got on i think it just adds a little something um and i think this would look really 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 beautiful actually with one of these dresses do you see what i mean with the knot okay this one looks all right actually <laughs> i don't know i just feel like it looks like it's not meant to be there up. I picked up this little straw bag. We all know I've got an obsession with straw at the moment. Anything straw, I love it. I think, I think this is really, really nice. Nice and lightweight as well. It's probably because it's empty. Lightweight. After I put my hordes of things in it, it will no longer be lightweight. Um, but I love the colours of this. I love the tan. I think it goes with white. I think it goes with black. Also goes with like sage green and stuff like that. Basically every colour in my entire wardrobe. Um, but I just thought this would be a nice little bag to take shopping so you haven't really got to hold it um and again i think it will just kind of like tie lots of outfits together h&m and also zara hack um sometimes if you go on h&m home they have like home wear on them same with zara home actually um you guys probably all know this and i'm just like incredibly late to the party but they have like really lovely loungewear on there that isn't actually included in the clothing section. Um, and also lovely sleep shirts like this, which I'm so happy about. I love sleeping in like a nice big oversized soft shirt when it gets a little bit warm. And this is a nude linen sleep shirt. It's really, really long. It literally comes down to like my knees. Um, really lovely lightweight material and yeah I just think these are a nice thing to sleep in or even just a nice thing to wear around the house on a hot day you've got cleaning to do you've got other things to do around the house and you just want to feel free get a sleep shirt okay, the last item from H&M home I picked up a black dressing gown I don't have a black dressing gown right and I don't know why I don't have one because I fake tan every single week and every single time when I've got fake tan on and it's really sticky I'm like what do I put on my body um and every single time I think do you know what a dressing gown would be great but all of my dressing gowns are white does the black dressing gown it's linen so it's really really lightweight it's almost like a bit of a kimono um 
when I fake tan, I can chill out for a little while and not worry about getting it all over everything. Right, my loves, it's time for a coffee break before we move on to Zara. So if you haven't already got a nice drink, pause the video, go get one. I am going to go and get myself a little coffee and then I shall be back for part two of this video. Cheers, everyone. Honestly, coffee's not working today. I feel like a bottomless pit and... I just, I feel like I could go sleep. Don't know what's wrong with me, I'm so tired. Okay, first up we have the spring top of dreams. Is that the right way round? Wound? Is that the right way round? It's like one of my favorite things that I own. I think it's so nice. Um, let me take it off the hanger so you can actually see. So again, you can wear this up, you can wear it off the shoulders. Um, it's a really, really, really lovely fit. I got this in a medium and it's a perfect fit. It was only 17 99 and it's just so pretty. These sleeves are like super exaggerated, um, which I love. They like really go out. And I think like when you have big sleeves, it's just so flattering and it's just so, so pretty. It also comes in here, which I'm not gonna lie. I wish it didn't have this like elastic part here because it does sit in a little bit of a weird place on your body. You'll see on the trial clips, but I feel like it sits at a little bit of an odd place. This is the definition of jeans and a nice top. I just feel like it's really floaty, really pretty, perfect for spring, summer. Oh, hello. Hello. I've got a little visitor. Hello, boy. I didn't even know he was in here. I've got the door closed and I just saw him appear. Where have you been? You tired boy. Oh, you don't want to kiss today. Okay, next up, an item that I've actually had for quite a while, um, but I haven't shown it to you guys in a Zara haul, so I thought I'd include it because it really is just like perfect for this time of year. I think this would look really lovely with a nice fitted pair of shorts, which I actually have to show you guys, um, or it would look nice with a shirt underneath, maybe a shirt dress like the one I've got on, or it would look nice with a little shirt and then some jeans, um, or some shorts. I just think a little knitted vest is a really, really nice piece to have in your wardrobe because you can wear it with so many different things. Okay, next we have my most asked about item of clothing. I've worn this in a few vlogs and you guys absolutely love this cardigan, which is this one. It's from Zara. They have it in stock, but be quick because it goes in and out of stock like there's no tomorrow. Um, it was, I think, £50. I've been on the hunt for like the perfect cardigan for such a long time um, that was super chunky, that wasn't itchy. This has got lovely big pockets. This is also almost maxi as well. It literally comes down to almost my ankles. And I love cardigans in the spring summer. I think cardigans look so cute with like a floaty little dress. They are perfect just to kind of take out with you. You can even pop them on your shoulders. And I think just adding a cardigan to a dress outfit just makes it so much cosier instantly. So just for reference, I got this in a large um, because I wanted it to be really, really slouchy and oversized. And I wanted to be able to like wear it off my shoulders and it be like really bunched. I would say it does come up quite oversized. Just depends how you really want it. But definitely probably could have got a small in this and it still would have been quite big so yeah i would probably say stick to your normal size in there next we've got a little basic but i really wanted to show you this because this is actually one of my favorite little t-shirts that i own i'm really really picky with t-shirts like they have to be the perfect fit i can't stand clingy arms i can't stand kind of like a like baggy neck um, but this is perfect. So I thought I would mention this one just in case you are picky with t-shirts like me and you are looking for look up there, looking for the perfect t-shirt to just go with anything. I wear stuff like this all the time. I think t-shirts are such a lovely thing to throw on with literally everything and I just think they're so casual but they can also be dressed up as well. It's just a real staple for me. So this is almost the, the, the sleeves and the neck are almost like sweatshirt sleeves um which is great because it gives them loads of structure i don't like like sloppy sleeves <laughs> that just kind of hang on your arm or they're tight on your arm i hate that so much um so this is kind of like a really nice big sleeve and when you have it on it kind of just like 
it just gives loads of structure and it looks really flattering it's also a perfect length as well it's not too cropped it's not too long perfect length to be able to tuck into your bottoms um, and also the neckline as well is the same kind of material as the sleeves so it's nice and structured around your neck you are a bit picky with t-shirts this one is brilliant and i think i'm actually going to order a few more of these um just because i know i'm gonna live in these in the summer especially when it gets a little bit warmer definitely gonna wear this a lot okay next we have the world's most amazing shorts i say this every single year but i'm i forever my whole life i have been after the perfect pair of tailored shorts that just fit really nicely they're the perfect length perfect color and the material is right and i've bought so many pairs of shorts hoping that they would be perfect and they never ever are but these are truly amazing so these are like a nice, I think they're called Bermuda, Bermuda short. It's probably completely wrong. Um, but these are like a tailored short. Got these in a size small and they are perfect. Really, really high waisted. They're really comfortable as well. The material is really thick as well. Um, so they're gonna hold their shape. Oh my God, these two together with some nice white sandals, a straw bag and a straw hat. It's gonna be amazing yeah, if you have been looking for a really lovely pair of smart shorts then these are so nice okay so this blouse i actually showed you guys this in a vlog um but i didn't try it on so i wanted to just show you it in this haul because i want to try it on style it so you can really see it so i picked up this blouse which usually isn't something i'd go for i feel like it's quite mumsy which i kind of like and as i'm getting older i kind of just like mum clothes even though i'm not a mum many mum to two cats but i just think it's really pretty um love how flowy it is it's got like this embroidered detail on it lovely pretty neckline i love a nice neckline um and i just thought again this would be so nice for a warm day to wear some shorts underneath and it's a little bit more relaxed um i kind of had a picture in my head of like like sat in like I don't know like rome or somewhere in italy with like a glass of rose and some pasta in this top i don't know why this top took me there um but i just thought it was really pretty thought it looked really nice as well with these kind of shorts just like out the bottom wow that that that, that looks like a good outfit doesn't it <laughs> next up we have some really lovely trousers um again same kind of situation with the shorts with these um i love the look of like trousers but they never fit me right and they just always feel a bit uncomfortable and they never like look right these are gorgeous so these are like a paper and it's a paper leg paper bag style trouser lovely material like the material is thick so again they're going to be structured they've got a nice tie detail so you can cinch yourself in nice big pockets these are cropped as well I've always had a bit of a problem with cropped trousers because my legs are about this long. Cropped trousers kind of just look like ankle swingers on me. Um, so I've always kind of like shied away from them. But these are really, really lovely length and they're also so high waisted as well. Um, and yeah, thought these would be great, nice and baggy so they're nice and free. I would wear these with some Birkenstocks and just a really plain top. So like this one. This is what I mean with this top, it just goes with so much. Okay, last item of clothing. I also showed you guys this in um, a vlog, but I didn't try it on, so I just wanna show you it on. This dress, this is very different for me. Um, not usually something I would go for, but I'm so glad that I kind of like stepped out of my comfort zone a little bit and got it because it really is so beautiful on. Um, I actually ordered two sizes in this, so I got an extra small and a medium. I would have liked the small, but it was out of stock. Um, and I would definitely, definitely say size down in this dress because it is very, very floaty. Um, and also, the fit of this is a little bit weird, um, so I would 100% wear a belt with it um, because it kind of does just hang and I feel like it does drown me a little bit. But when I pop on a black belt, it kind of just gives it a lot more shape. The neckline is so pretty. Again, you've got a nice like ruffled bit here, which is so cute. I love the black and white flowers. I feel like it's still very, it, it's minimal but busy. <laughs> They're like two completely opposite words. Um, but it's still like neutral but also floral. I don't really know what I'm saying at this point. Um, but I love the 
I love the ruffled arms and yeah I think this will just look really nice don't know where I'm gonna wear it to okay last few bits from Zara I've got a few accessories I've also noticed as well I've got some bits from Zara home as well so yeah let me know if you would like to see a Zara home and H&M home haul because I've got lots of really lovely neutrally bits to show you um so the last two bits I got from Zara was this hat love a cap at the moment i think they look so cute with outfit i just thought this one was a little bit different it's like a really really soft material um i mean it's not going to look right really i don't think with my hair like this but it's such a nice fit like it's really thick um i do find sometimes with caps they do squeeze my head um to a point where i feel like it might explode but this one's just a really nice Fit. and I thought this would be perfect for like a Sunday with a nice cozy loungewear set, trench coat um, and I love how it's like an oatmeal colour as well, I thought that was really pretty. Got these little pearl hoops which I thought was so pretty and I thought as well these would go with any of the white dresses that I have just to like kind of dress them up a little bit more, make them a little bit more pretty. So my loves, that is going to go ahead and end today's haul. I really, really hope you enjoyed it. Um, like I said, I will link absolutely everything down below. If anything is out of stock, um, I will try and find either a link or a code or find something similar as well. I would say as well, if you haven't seen Sunday's vlog, we have a very, very special announcement in that vlog um, where we are actually bringing out a brand in the next few months. I don't want you guys to miss it because we have very very limited stock and we'll have some giveaways and stuff going on on that instagram so i'll leave all of them details down below um and also the instagram on screen now you could go and give it a follow it would mean the absolute world to me super exciting times ahead um i'll speak a little bit more about it and maybe give you guys some sneak peeks in sunday's vlog but yeah thank you all so much for your support so far it's been amazing i shall catch up with you guys on sunday for a nice long vlog as always thank you so much for watching love you all so much and i'll see you on sunday bye